Jank little moment. Okay, so I've got my friend my screamer. Let's talk to our dad. Hmm, so you got four gym badges. Fine, as I promised, we will have a Pokemon battle. Steven, I'm so happy that I could have a few battle with my child, my own child, but a battle is a battle. I will do everything in my power as a gym leader to win. Steven, you better get it your best shot too. I don't think I mentioned this in part one, but actually, this in third generation for Beast of Friend Emerald, you actually see your dad. You never see your dad in other games though, like in Pokemon Gold, Silver, Crystal, or Pokemon Fire in Leaf Green, or Red, or Blue, and Yellow. So for example, a couple examples right there. But yeah, you see your dad in this game. Weird and normal like the battle. Cool. It's yes, locking level 28. Cool. So, uh, let's go for the stealing, I guess. It's gonna use John. Of course, the next turn it's gonna wolf around though, so that's good. Stealing hits, awesome. It does that much, okay, well. Scream is defense always throws, that's cool. Let's uh, go for another stealing, I guess. It's wolfing around, yep, okay. But in the next turn it's gonna attack, so like, I'm gonna. Scream is gonna fall asleep though. Oh, defense throws again, awesome, that's good to know. That's good actually. Scream fell asleep, but we have to use a blue fruit then. Luckily, with the blue fruit at least, you know. Yeah, there we go. Now, Screamer woke up. Cool. Facade. Okay, that's the normal type move. It doesn't do too much, though, because uh, Screamer is half steel type and it resists it. Let's go for another stealing. It's going to loaf around. I'm going to try to uh, weaken it down so like, it doesn't reach the red health so I can just knock it out, hopefully. Let's go for the air cutter this time. It's going to use faint attack. Faint attack won't be, super, won't be very effective either on Screamo. So, we're, we're, you know, Screamo is holding up pretty good right now. The two, the two defense row stats would be good. Oh, no, it's going to heal. Let's go for the swift so it never misses, at least then. Just hyper potion. I'd rather use its, its hyper potions now than later. So, uh, that's good. We can still win this thing. Let's go for the stealing on this thing. Facade, okay. It's not going to do... Oh, man, critical hit. Jeez, that negates the defense stat raises that uh, Screamer got from stealing. Okay. That's okay, then. Okay, more... Oh, three defense raises. Awesome, nice. Stat raises, I should say. Stages. It's all fun around. It's gonna, are we gonna use stealing again? So it's good to like wither around to help. I could just, you know, send out a fighter and try to sweep through his team, but I want to give Screamo some screen time too, because I know Screamo has potential to really work, help me in this fight, so yeah. It's gonna wolf around this time, but then after this turn, after this stealing, Screamo will fall back asleep. I uh, so put in a red health again, so it's gonna probably heal, but um, I'm actually probably going to use a full restore actually. Because it heals the sleep and it will full restore um, Screamo's health. So let's do that, yeah. Okay, yeah, it's going to use Yawn again. Okay, oh, it didn't heal, nice. So let's uh, use Stealing again. Hopefully, it'll knock it out. It's going to wolf around this turn, this turn, I should say. So there we go. The slacking should go down. And it does. Awesome, nice. Scream again, 1,260 experience. Awesome, nice. Scream is on level 30, awesome. Sent out slacking. Oh, is it gonna go for the, his other slacking? Okay, let's go for, um. Hmm. I'm kinda thinking Geico. I don't know. Geico has. needs some screen time, I guess. Okay, slacking, nice. Okay, let's see here. Let's use, uh, Leaf Blade on this thing. It's gonna use facade. It's gonna hurt actually. Yeah, it's gonna do. Wow, wow, man, that thing is. Yeah. But then now that I switched out to different Pokemon, Screamo's attack stats. Or not attack, but defense stats are gonna go back down to three stages. Which kinda stinks. So I'm gonna go to Fighter next, I guess. Let's go, um, with the fake out. Yeah, there we go, nice. Gonna it's gonna wolf around anyway. Okay, cool. Let's go for the um. Let's go for arm thrust. Okay, yeah, it's gonna. Yeah, it's gonna tighten it its focus. Okay, that's not good. That's for that's a try it's trying to use focus punch right here. But we it's going to make it lose its focus because uh, we hit it, you know. So make sure you hit it whenever Slacking's trying to you know raise its tighten its focus for a focus punch. It's a two turn move. It has to tighten its focus without getting hit by move, and then um. Oh shoot, this compared to its red health, jeez. Okay, whatever. Hopefully you don't heal. And then, um, it's gonna try to go in the second. If it doesn't get hit by a physical move, then it's gonna try to use focus, but it's gonna use focus punch in the next turn. So you have to be 
wait, wait about that. It's gonna, oh, it's gonna get a hyper potion. Okay, at least the fighter gets a vital thrift out of this, you know, on it, so that's good. This sucking is level 31 and level 3rd, uh, male. Um, awesome, it did a little bit over half, cool. It's gonna level for a round, hopefully, this vital throw will take it out. And the previous sucking was only level 28, so this one's a little bit stronger. We take out the sucking, awesome. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna use Vetagroth next. Okay, I'll switch. Oh, no, I won't switch. I'm gonna s stick in with, a uh, uh, with Fighter. Um, let's try Arm Thrust first. Um, Vegaroth is the pre-evolved form of Slacking, but evolved form of Slackoth. Um, and it does not have the, uh, t Torrent ability, um, so it attacks every turn, so keep that in mind. This Vegaroth is level 30, so this thing's kinda fast too, so keep that in mind. Let's go for the Vital Throw. It's gonna just slash it again, okay, cool. Vital Throw's gonna hit, awesome, because it always goes second, but always hits. And we're gonna take it out, awesome. So overall, that battle wasn't too hard. I mean... The slacking, the second slacking did faint Geico in one hit with the facade, but that's okay. Okay, players defeated Noi- okay, we defeated the leader Noi, nice. Hold on, let me go to my notes for my movesets, because I know I'm going to teach one of my Pokemon the TM is going to give me. I accidentally opened Paint that now on my other computer, jeez. I didn't mean to do that, I meant to go to my notes. Let me scroll up. Let's see here. Yeah, okay, how I'm, how I'm, I'm gonna teach Facade to how I'm apparently according to my final movesets for my notes. I can't. I, I can't. I can't believe it. Steven? I lost to Steven? But rules are rules. Here, take this. We get 3100 Poké Dollars. Thanks, Dad. That was a nice battle. Uh, we received the Balance Badge from Dad. Nice. So that's a fifth gym badge of home. Nice. With that badge, uh, the defense of all your Pokemon will increase. Pokemon that you that, that know that your move safe will be able to travel over water. This is my gift to you, Steven. I'm sure you can use it correctly. This is TM42, which is Facade, which is the movie used that one hit KO my Geico. <laughs> yeah, TM42 uh, contains Facade. It it um doubles the power if the move is if of moves if it's paralyzed if it's poison paralyzed or burned. It may be able to t turn a bad situation to a good intuitive advantage. That's awesome. As a Pokemon gym leader, I can't express how upset I am, but as a father, I am. It makes me both happy and a little sad. It's odd. You need just faces the other way. Oh yes, okay. I can, he's even to think for a second, I guess. Oh yes. Well, his parents came calling earlier. They said they had something that they wanted to give you, Stephen. That's HMZ3 Surf by the way, if you didn't know. So I was gonna pick that up actually. Let's teach facade to um. Fighter though, let's get out of the gym first before we do that, and talk to the vice keeper and read the statue again. You know the drill, so we have to do this with like every gym, really. <laughs> Steven, whoa, you became even your own father. Like, whoa, what a stunning turn of events. Thanks, man. Okay, so let's start, let's read the statue. Pedalburg City Pokemon Gym, Norman Certified Trainer Steven. Awesome. 